With this video, we will show you how to delete an image. If anything is not clear, please go to the Wepler docs. We need a data source that singles out our selected image. To do that we create a data detail data source. Click on image data view. Click the plus sign. Add after, data and data detail. Give the data detail a recognizable ID. Click on data source. Choose images data view data. Reload the page to update our details. The key will be the data detail, image ID. Our delete form will be housed in a modal. To add a modal, choose the last modal in the app structure panel. Click on the plus sign. In the pop-up, choose after. Click on modal. Give the modal a recognizable ID. Choose the fade effect. Click on modal header. Change the color to light. Change the background to danger. Change the text of the title to, delete image. Select the modal body text and change it to warn of no return. Click on the body text. Click the plus sign. In the pop-up, choose after. Click on generators and bootstrap for form generator. In the modal, select the images delete step as the source. Populate the form with the data detail values. Remove the two bottom fields. We do not need the display order and we will use the modal button to submit the form. Change the type of the remaining fields to hidden. Click OK. Select the image delete form and change the ID to be more recognizable. Go to Dynamic Events. Choose Server Connect and Success. Reload the image's Server Connect. Hide the modal. Select the Save Changes button. Change the style to danger. Change the button text. Choose dynamic events. In the pop-up choose mouse click. For the action, choose form submit. Choose the modal. Click on Dynamic Events. In the pop-up, choose Modals Hide. For the action, choose Form Reset. Click Preview Mode. Hide the modal. Click on a gallery. Click Preview Mode. Choose the Delete button. Click on Dynamic Events. In the pop-up choose Mouse Click. 
For the action choose data detail select. For the key, select data detail image ID. We need to change the value because of our data detail usage is not as recommended by Wepler. For our on-click event, we also need to show the modal. Save our document and we are done. We can now test our page. In our next video, part 22 of our tutorial, we will sort our images into a display order. Thank you for watching.